my name is Vito Rivera. I'm with the UIC Human Performance Lab, and I'm here to tell you about the benefits of the hydrostatic weighing test. One of the benefits is that it has an error plus or minus 1 to 2 percent, and it's also a great way to have a starting point in an exercise program. So initially, you would do one hydrostatic weighing today, and then three to six months from now, do another test to see exactly where you're So, what I need to do is just stand in front of the lab for now. Go ahead and let me hold. I'll have you hold stuff. So, right now, I'm going to re zero the scale. And we're all set. So you can go ahead, right behind you, there's a chair. Just go ahead and take a seat there for now. Okay, I'll give you the instructions. No problem. You stay on the top of that pipe the entire time. Don't hook them underneath. Don't rub them up against the sides. Next, your hands. I need them there on the sides. Uh, I just need them there to anchor to the scale. You don't need to pull yourself underneath. Uh, that's what bottom underneath the water is going to be. So, what I do need you to do is, it has to be completely submerged under water. While you're underneath the water, I need you to blow out as much air as you can. From my point of view, I see all these air bubbles coming up. The moment they stop, I'm under the assumption you got rid of as much as you could. At that point, I start taking the reading. Once I've gotten it, I'll yell at you to the water and go ahead and come back up. Now, at any point while you're underneath the water, if you're like, I need air right now and I just gotta come up, just go ahead and come on up. There's no problem with that. So you're in control the entire time. Uh, we're going to do this a minimum of three times. Uh, after that, I'll make recommendations as to whether we should go on or not. All right, Bethany, you can go ahead and come on up. Additional benefits to doing the hydrostatic weighing test also include immediate results. Uh, those results include uh, body density, uh, fat mass, and fat-free mass. Uh, again, this is the most accurate way to assess body fat with the error of plus or minus 1 to 2% and to see if your exercise program is going in the right direction. Thank you.